If you're running a part through multiple operations with different setups or even on different machines, it is possible to carry the resulting stock throughout the process with NCSIML. During the first operation, run the material removal simulation as you normally would, verifying all errors, undefined codes, and over travels for accuracy. Upon completion, NCSIML will automatically hold the rest stock or operation result in memory. Apply and return to the overall project and now enter the second operation. As you can see, the starting point is now the endpoint of Operation 1 following the new orientation defined in the setup. To add this feature, use the drop down from Functions and select Copy Stock. Choose the operation that the stock is coming from, the stock name, and the stock from the current operation to replace. When the function is executed, you will notice that it looks like the one from before. Now simply run the simulation for Operation 2 and it will continue to machine the other side of the part to create a completely end-to-end -end machining process. You can also run a comparison simulation to verify that all other features on either setup are falling into tolerance, noted by the coloring and any measurements that you wish to take off the surface. Continue the process for any number of stocks in the machine environment or any number of setups, always ensuring that your operations are beginning with the stock result of the true G-code running at the real machine.